Ha ha. Yes, I am first. You all shall bow before my greatness. I need to go get water! Well, j just know I'm doing the lurk now, or the, the hydrate now. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Thank you for the lurk, darling. Kerbo! I'm doing good, Kerbo. How are you doing? I'm almost done with all the buildings for the for Palea. Oh, we're just gonna. Hello. Hi. Uh, yeah. So I almost have the whole U. Um. Actually, I have enough of the buildings. I'm just waiting for them to be built now. Um, I'm gonna say about doing like a small room. So like. Here's the U. <laughs> here's the harvest house. Here's the the end. I'm thinking of adding on small houses on the ends to give it like a almost close circle. I'm doing good. I'm actually a little tired, um, which is why I'm streaming a little earlier. Just finished with Star playing Palea. Just laid down to rest. <gasps> Y'all did it by me. I did see you guys on earlier. I was like, oh. Uh, I didn't stay on too long. I have been reading clips. I'm in my Twilight Air. Um, almost halfway through. Almost to half. Maybe halfway. Um, but yes, yeah, so I'm going to try and finish that today if possible. But uh, I wanted to play Pokemon. So uh, just to let you guys know, these are the Pokemon that we are catching and collecting and getting distracted by. Star was playing other games and ended with Palea, I see. Did I ever put the shiftry in the right place? I caught the shiftry yesterday. Where did it go? Wait, where did shiftry go? It was at the end of the stream today. I gone to where mouse hold is. There it is. Ta da. Uh, but yeah, no, I. You have another pin. Oh my goodness. Okay, so Shiftry will go to the same box as there. I think that's the right spot. I think, yeah. Um, Whose pin did you get? But look at you building relationships. Whereas I'm just like, la 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 cake. Money, fish, bugs. Oh, I do. I definitely feel like I don't have a lot of energy today, but we'll, we'll see how long I, I did. I do stream. The center has been staring me. Yeah, Gina's. I just started dating Gina. Um, but yeah, we'll see if I actually make progress today. Gina, uh, this item. Have Bomantis. 
Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. let's switch out King Gambit for. Let's use Iron Valiant. Like Iron Valiant. Pretty strong Pokemon. Yeah, you do have a chef now. Did you go with Hodaddy? Uh, Pokemon Wistful Fields are strong. I'll check whether you're ready to go there. Did, did you go with Hodaddy? Hanami the Delinquent. Wow. So we had the Ruffian. Ruffian. Now we have a Delinquent. Who's all these people living in Kitagami? Got a Spinarak. Okay. You went with Hodaddy. Nice! Even though we all think that we're gonna be able to romance him at some point. <gasps> we could be Najima's stepmommy! <laughs> I love it. Rock Rough. I might try Sawaddle. I don't have any good grass type moves. I mean, Poliwag has Hydro Pump. I can try that. Oh my goodness. I, I do feel like I, I need a nap. It's only 10.51 and I already feel as if I need a nap. Thank you darling for the stretch! And even if that's the case you will romance him. Oh my goodness! Oh. Yeah, oh earth power. I might go hydro pump because it's stronger. And I'm faster. Nice! And a hydrate! I defeated the delinquent. You're more than ready. Yeah, I am. Okay. Where am I even going? I need to go up to Loyalty Plaza. That is destination. There we go. You need a nap too? Yeah, I honestly like... I feel good. I Like mentally I feel well. I'm just sleepy. That's- I think that's the best way to describe it. I'm sleepy. You need more than a nap. My problem is that my naps tend to not be naps. They tend to be, um, five hours at the minimum. <laughs> like, I- I apparently don't know how to take a nap. I only know how to sleep. Are you a Pokemon trainer? Rotom phone apps. Hey, I'm a traveling app developer. I see you've got a Rotom phone. Here, let me add a snazzy new feature for you. Yay! Match your phone case. Cute! <clears throat> so I'm gonna get Strigatito. Nice. Mm -hmm. Technology really is incredible. So you wouldn't get that if you weren't if you didn't have the DLC. Huh. Huh. Okay, so we're at Loyalty Plaza. So is this the signpost I need to take a selfie with? Uh, I totally know how to... Selfies. I totally know how to do this. There we go. Okay, so why switches to here? Rotate. Use roto stick. Not enough space. Use roto stick. Use roto stick now. Okay. Oh. I know how to do this. I know how to do this. Why? Roto stick. There we go. And so I take a selfie here. Did I, did I do the thing? Everybody has Vulpixes! That's the first signboard. But, sorry, did I startle you? I, I didn't mention anything back and follow you here. You're supposed to read the signboard, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, I, I already know the whole story, so go ahead. You should check it out.
Long, long ago, there was a fearsome ogre in the land of Kitami. Oh no, Aurora's escaped! Oh, no one tried to catch it. The ogre made its home in the mountain behind the village, frightening all who ventured there. One day, the ogre came down from the mountain in a terrible rage, causing great fear in the village. By some stroke of luck, Okidoki, Munkidori, and Fezan de Piti all happened to be there as well. The three Pokemon laid down their lives to fend off the ogre and send it back to the mountain. In admiration, the people of the village bestowed upon this brave trio the title The Loyal Three. The remains were given a proper burial, and statues of the three were erected above the site. The Loyal Three Monument is right over there. But don't you think the ogre in that folktale sounds kind of cool? I think? Come on, it was all alone. The battle was three against one, but the ogre still managed to hold its own. That's way cool. Well, but I guess most people would just think an ogre like that is scary, huh? I don't think there's any reason to be afraid. When I was little, I went up on the mountain so many times that night, all my own, and I never met it, that ogre. The only, scary things, the only scary thing that happened was the grown-ups giving me a real earful about it. Um, so yeah, we're supposed to take a photo in front of the signboard, right? I did that. I don't have a smartphone. Could you? How do you not have a smartphone in this day and age? Oh, I don't actually have to take the selfie. They'll do it themselves. Aw, Karen's cute. Also adorable. That turned out great. You're even good at taking photos. S sorry, not to butter you up or anything. No, I don't want to have to come to do this. I didn't want to have. I didn't want to have to come to do this whole school trip thing. But well, it might actually be kind of fun. Are we gonna have a romance arc? Are we having a romance arc? Okay, I get to be out in nature around my hometown and talk to you, Sam. Hey, you want, maybe we could set up a picnic. Would you like a sandwich? Oh, you said the magic word. Yeah! What is that thing? Some kind of kaiju or something? Um, this is my ride. It's called Karidon. It's called Karidon, and you ride on it, huh? I've never seen another Pokemon like this. It seriously comes out whenever it hears the word sandwich? I guess! Never thought I'd actually get to meet such an awesome Pokemon. No wonder you're so strong, Sam. You're, you're special. We're definitely having a romance arc, y'all. We, we are definitely having romance. So the next, er, we should go find the next signboard. It's on the grounds of Kitakami Hall. Um, Kitakami Hall is, well, first level back to the town from here, then there's a bridge you cross, and from there you'll need to climb up the mountainside. I'll hang back for now and meet you there later. Guys, I think he likes me. I think he likes me. Uh, yeah? Come on, Gridon. Okay. Um, he said that the monument. Uh. Can't be the monument. They said that they erected statues of them. Oh, this is the monument. Interesting. Okay. Want to check out this raid? Terra Raid. Oh, also item. Yan Mega? That might be Yan Mega. Sweet. Um, we're gonna change. It's a grass type. We'll just go with back with a flame crocodile. Skeleters. That way I don't have to evolve my Yanma, I can just let it go. Let it go, let it go. Great. 
raids are taking a long time to lo oh never mind I take that back yeah it's Yan Mega nice where did where did these people come from they're not on the school trip they're not on the school trip These guys are super strong. I can get one more off. I can Rastalize. No, not with hypnosis. That's fine. I will do a heal chair. Uh, heal up. And that'll wake me up. There we go. Handy dandy. Wait, I'm not awake. Am I awake? Okay, I am awake. Good, 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 good. Okay, I should be able to terrestrialize. How dare you take away my special attack boosts? That's not fair! Rastalize and whoop this bug's butt. <laughs> Yay, paralysis with the world. There's the energy. Okay, now I'm confused. Oh, good, that's the dude on sparse. Not me. Should do, yeah, I was about to say, this should do hefty damage because I'm getting my special attack boosts. That should break, yeah, there we go. There we go. There are those big hits that I need. And I'll be able to catch her, capture this. Yan Mega. Used a Yan Mega. Maybe I'll put that on my team. Noise. Noise, noise, noise. Most excellent. So we'll check, fix up our boxes real fast. I can release the Yan uh, that's in my party, and then I can get another, probably another Poly World on my team, because I have to get the Poly. evolve into a Poly Whirl, a Poly Wrath, and a Poly Swirl. Oh, the Sprigatita is so cute! Adorable. So I can release you. Yan Mega, go all the way back. 
I'm really glad that they updated the box so that it will actually, like, load faster. Um... Four fish evolve. Ta da! Do a crawdont. I feel like that's an update that you should be able to get even in without the DLC. The um, updated. Um, Rotom Phone? That's so cute, and it has not, it doesn't really do much with the DLC. Oh, I still need to get another Bell Sprout. How have I forgotten that? And some Pokedex progress going. Arb. Crunch is good, yeah. Crunch. Ooh, Belch is nice. Oh, must be holding a berry. I have a bunch of berries I could give. Okay. Nice. You might buy your the DLC for your birthday. Do it. Totally worth it. Um, I will say apparently I did not buy it for Violet. Oh no! <laughs> apparently I did not buy it for um. Violet. I only bought it for Scarlet. I'm so mad at myself because I was I laid down to play the the DLC in Violet. I'm like I'll just you know work on training Pokemon and all that. Oh, I'm so mad at myself. Do not hit B. Hit B. But the DLC is pretty cute. And you get so many more Pokemon. Um. What? Ugh! Y'all, oh, I'm so bad at controls. Oh, it didn't. didn't do it. Okay. What? Rupert is evolving? No way! But I have to evolve this one into Divani, so I still need to use another experience candy on you. Because we have the Swaloon. Do not need It's probably a grass stone, okay.
This is cute, yeah. Or leaf stone. Well, I mean, I meant water stone. How do I evolve leaf Annie? Um, the copy. Okay, Dad. Oh, Levani is friendship. Okay. And then how do I get Polly Swirl? Oh, it's Polly Toad. Oh my god. Uh, that's King's Rock. I have to trade with the King's Rock? Shoot. Okay. I have to wait till I have a friend who has the DLC? Do they need to have the, the DLC for this? I don't know. Question mark. Alright, well then, what I'm going to do... I'm going to give you the suit cell. I'm going to give you... King's Rock. Yes, I added you as a friend. I I have sent the friend request. Alright. Yeah. Fire back. Yeah, turning switches on. Very helpful. <laughs> Okay, uh, so I need to catch another bell sprout, but also grab gambit. You have three switches. Dang, I have one, and I can claim a reward. Yee! I got love balls. Let's get rid of the exclamation marks. I want a Vulpix! Yeah. Okay. City! Hello! How are you? I hope you're having a fantastic day. I need to go find a bell sprout. Oh, here's a trainer. You have the Animal Crossing Switch, which I want. The first OLED in the Zelda OLED. Nice. Yeah, I got just a normal Switch. If you're naughty... If you're naughty, the scary ogre will come and eat you up. Go say the festival boy. Um, yeah, I want to get an OLED, because I have a bigger screen, but, Psycho Cut. T! Oh my gosh, everyone's coming out! Hey! I guess I shouldn't be surprised to see T and City together. Doing well, City? Good, I'm glad. I hope everyone is doing great. You got your annoying work issue fixed. That's good. That is always good. Me, I'm just chilling and vibing. I'm pretty tired. You need to do a work report? Oof. Oof. Um, cricket tot. I'll leave Iron Valley in it. That's never fun. I'm just chilling and vibing. I've been, I've, I've been reading all morning. And I was like, I want to play Pokemon. But... I also need to do it on stream because I'm doing the DLC. And I did buy the DLC for Violet, and I'm sad. On paper spend? Oh, that does. Uh... Yeah, this is the the DLC. So we're, we are in Kitakami. We've unlocked the Kitakami Pokedex. 
which is right here. These are the new, these are the Pokemon in Kitakami. If it's yellow, it is a new Pokemon. If it's red, um, it's a Scarlet exclusive. And if it's purple, it's a Violet exclusive. So we're working on filling up our Pokedex. Uh, the Kitakami Pokedex will have 200 Pokemon in it. But that's also including Pokemon from Paldea. So, yeah. Yeah, we're vibing. Finish the game, but don't think you're gonna get the DLC. That's fair enough. You love this game, you need the DLC. <laughs> I am enjoying it. Um, I think it's cute. Uh, do it! Apples, I love them. I love them raw, I love them cooked, I even love them in battle. Oh, are you gonna use the new Applin evolution? Nami the festival girl. There's Applin, cute. Go Iron Valiant. Cause um, the main thing with the DLC, there's only one town. Oh, nice crit. Um, there's so many Pokemon to catch, and it's a cute little story. You're on a field trip. Another Applin? Are you only using Applin? Because that's a little boring. Applin is really cute. I think it's getting a third evolution. Hold up, let me check the Pokedex I just pulled up. Uh... Yay, I won. You literally used two Applin. I could have sworn there's another Applin evolution in the DLC. Uh, yeah, it's called Diplin. And it's really cute. It's using... Syrupy Apple to get. Hold up. Like, look at this. Look how cute this is. It is a... Brass Dragon. So yeah, there's now a third Applin evolution. Seeing the syrupy apple. It's like it is like a candy apple. It's called Diplin. Oh my darling Applin. Oh my darling, oh my darling. This centret loves me. Heck it's like watching Ekans go through the world is so cool. Is this an Applin? It's a Terra Applin. Yes. Oh no! I missed the Terra Applin! I also love my hair color. Is your dream hair color? It is mine as well. I love Merida and I, I wanted to get my Merida heels in. So, this is a... Merida inspired. It's weird having red hair though, because I'm I, I have dark brown hair. Okay. Let's just do a psycho cut. Hmm. And we're gonna switch to King Gambit because you have uh false swipe. Thank you! And I just got it touched up this Tuesday, so... I, I had, like, serious roots going on. My hair grows so fast. Like, I have to touch my hair up so quickly. But I'm lazy, so I let my roots really grow in. There we go. Apple is so cute. And I think I got one of the syrupy apples. There we go. Raise that defense. Doesn't matter to me. Doesn't matter to me. You're gonna be a Diplin. Let's see, maybe repeat ball. That was your hair color for years, but it started to lighten over the years? Yeah, my hair used to be light and it got dark over the years because I stopped going outside as much. I, I honestly just don't go outside in the sun anymore. My hair used to be so light. I used to be blonde, honestly. Okay, I got Applin juice. 
Okay. And then I think I got... That is the wrong button. I also need to go over here. There we go. No, oh, well, yes. Oh, I did catch the extra bell sprout. Okay. Y'all, I am so totally focused. I am the most focused person you will ever meet. Love you. I see you. Have I seriously never caught an Applin before? What? Okay, um... Syrupy Apple. Oh, I don't have a Syrupy Apple. Okay. Where does Centric go? Next to Bellsprout. Bell sprout. Switch with Applin. And then this Applin goes after Burret. There we go. I don't need to catch another bell sprout. Wait, wasn't there uh I was gonna say wasn't there an HM? That is I'm sorry, but seeing Ekans like actually slithering so oh my god! I talked to it. Oh my god. My roommate just scared the crap out of me. I don't know what I thought was gonna happen. I don't know what I thought was going to happen. You were alt-tabbed, you only heard the screen. Yeah. Hold up, why is my cat cam not coming up? We were working before. There we go. Welcome to Hedgehog Sitting. This is Heidi. Say hello to Heidi. She's a hedgehog. Thank you for the hydrate. Oh my god, I was legitimately scared. That Sentra is just like creeping closer you had a hedgehog nice yeah this is heidi my roommate's hedgehog that centric seriously just the creep up on me look at her there's heidi hi heidi you want to sit in my lap heidi are you good in there Okay. <laughs> I legitimately had a heart attack. That was terrifying. <laughs> oh, your boy Randy passed away about 18 months ago? That's not even that long ago. I'm so sorry, Kerbo. Oh. Yeah, no, this is uh, my roommate's second hedgehog. Her first one was Hercules. Um, and he was her emotional- Oh, I did not see that apple one. Um, he was her emotional support animal. Um, and now she has Heidi. She she rescued Heidi. Heidi's not as social as Hercules was. Seems pretty curious. They don't live long, which is sad, yeah. Want me to hold you, Heidi? I can hold you. Oh, there's another trainer. Did I just miss all these trainers on my way up? Hey there. You've got to greet a person properly if you want to have a pleasant battle. Now let's go. Okay, Tatsuro. Oh, Heidi, you're coming out. Hi. Like, 
Hey, please. Look at me. Fight me. You're okay. It's the first time she hasn't hissed at me. Oh, Heidi. I'm so sorry, my dear. How fast can you stay in there? I do have to ask that you stay in there. That she looks similar to Randy. Oh, that is that's so sad and sweet. Hey, I I am gonna have to ask you to stay in there though. So sorry, my girly. Oh. <laughs> Don't you want to stay in your nice little comfy home? She's never this inquisitive whenever she comes to my room. You smell the kitty? Is that what's up? Oh, you smell the food. Yeah, okay, good girl. Now that I know she's not coming on out. Okay. I'm worried about her falling out because she's in the cat tree right now. We'll post some pics of him. Please do. Oh my gosh. That would be so sweet. Randy loved chasing the cats. Yeah, the cats are interested in her. There's nothing like the warm glow of good sportsmanship. Okay, look how big they've gotten. Um, I do need to go into town to heal up my Pokemans. I want a Growlithe! Wait, I think I actually brought my Growlithe over from Legends of Arceus. I just need to find the syrupy apple now. No, she hasn't really met the cats. Botan sniffed her, but I don't think Heidi's really... I mean, I think maybe they touched noses once, but Heidi's more antisocial. Oh, good girly. Okay, can I buy a syrupy apple over here? Lovely of you to stop by. Take your time and have a look around. Let's buy items. Mm. Oh, darn. Oh, I can buy clothing? Hold up. Shut up. What clothing can I get? Uh, socks. And gloves. Okay. <gasps> I didn't even notice this little chime. It looks like a chime echo. Cute. Okay. Um, there is a Terra Raid over here. Let's go check it out, because it's a good way to get, um, the new Pokemon. Oh, I already have a Pearly Wrath, or Pearly Whirl. Let me find the next location. Here it is. I already have rock. Oh, there's a ferret. Hold up, let me just catch this fur instead of having to evolve my Sentret. Come 
Noish, 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 noish. Oh, Hello there. Hello there. Thank you for the follow, Skylar Cloud. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Welcome in. Uh, I need to switch over to King Gambit. I hope you're having a fantastic day. I'm doing pretty good myself. I'm having a chill day. We're, we're, we're just chilling today. Let's do some false swiping. I did do your hydrate. I didn't announce it, but I'll do another one because I am thirsty. Okay. Maybe a nest ball would look cute. You totally missed it. It was also on the sly. It, I think it happened right when I got, when I got scared. Uh, yeah, we'll just try a great ball. Lag, gotta love it. But it never hurts to hydrate even more. Go. Her is so cute. Okay. So I can actually release one of the Sentret. I love how Sentret looks like it, it's ready to square up with you. What's after Mighty Yenna? Uh, Illumise and Volbeat. Okay. Hold up. I want to see these pictures. Oh, Randy does look like Heidi. Oh, shut up. They look so similar. Oh my goodness. Turbo, Randy is so cute. Oh, what a sweetie pie. Um, I haven't bought this Pokemon game yet. Is it worth it? I've been skeptical on these newer Pokemon games. I like the OG style with the gems in Elite Four. Um, this game I enjoy because it has that Pokemon feel with the open world. Um, a lot of people are dissatisfied with, like, the graphics because, um, in the background, like, the people are really buggy and laggy. Um, I will definitely have to show her. I, I will show Jean. Um... But no, this game, I, I really enjoy it. Um, I really like the open world feel, but I also have ADHD. So, like, I get distracted really easily. Um, you get to, to the ride Pokemon. They have made some things a little too easy, in my opinion. Um, like, being able to just switch your Pokemon out through the boxes. Like, <gasps> there's the Vulpix I wanted. <laughs> Um, so I do think it's worth it just because it, it's fun. I wouldn't get both versions though. Um, just because it, there really isn't that much of a difference, but that usually, that'll happen. Um, hold up. I need this Vulpix like now. Um, but yeah, I, I think it's worth it, but I would only get one version. I wouldn't get both. Um, because they are practically identical. I thought that there would be some differences, but it, the differences really aren't that much. Um, I never played Sword and Shield or Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. Um, but I, I think it's cute. Um, I mean, I have a whole playlist of me playing this game. If you wanted to look that up on YouTube, it's the same handle as here um oh in a hair cross i don't know if hair cross is new really diamond shining pearl was really good okay um bug type i really enjoyed arceus yeah arceus was really fun um that introduced the open world aspect as well uh legends of arceus um and i feel like 
Violet and Scarlet definitely built off of that open world feel. You enjoyed it too, sissy? <laughs> Arceus really was amazing. Um, it definitely... I, I still play Arceus. City, not sissy. I mean, it's better than Star's nickname for City. It's a good thing I don't have a list. Um, is Heracross a new Pokemon? Is that what Pokemon I should have caught? Um, no, Heracross is not. Your phone's calling you out, City. Yeah, you've had worse. <laughs> oh shoot, it's timed. It's timed. Why am I wasting time? <laughs> um, I, like I said, I think it's worth it if you only buy one version. I don't know if the DLC is worth it. I bought it back when I wasn't worried about money. <laughs> I think the DLC might be worth it because um, I've been having fun with it. Uh, I just hate that it's $35 on top of the $60 you need to do to buy the game. So, like, it's a lot. It's a lot. Um, there are three different paths that you can go on. Uh, and there is a Pokemon League. So there is that. We were there when the group of us met City at the Maji Market on the first day. Both standing next to each other. <laughs> T came back to sissy. You have shield and Arceus, uh, brilliant pot pearl. You barely play them. Yeah, I never got sword and shield because I didn't have a switch when they came out. And then when I got the switch, I was like really into Animal Crossing. But also, I'm a broke person. <laughs> that was funny. Uh, I was not there, but I can imagine how funny it was. Um. I play this a lot. I just I just like doing the terror raids and I hang out with my roommate in the game. I like that you can have a multiplayer aspect. I think that that's something that's really, really fun is having that multiplayer aspect where I can invite my friends to my world and then we, we can just be doing our own thing, but in the same world and like once in a while you'll run into people and I think that that's really fun. Okay, um, so I know that Nuzleaf goes next to Shiftry. Where does Vulpix go? Oh, Vulpix! I don't see- uh, okay, next to Apple. Next to the Apple. Go. Yeah. Sword of Shield was your intro to Pokemon and you enjoyed it. I have been playing Pokemon since Red and Blue. And I remember, um, in middle school or it must have been middle school um there, i had a friend who had gold and silver in japanese um yeah collecting the mods but battling in the running in the grass was so annoying too yeah i don't yeah i'm kind of torn on running into them in the like overworld but it does make it more realistic. And then just like seeing them interact in the, I don't know, I'm torn. I like it, but I also hate it. Especially when they're tiny. Especially when they're itty bitty. What are you doing, Heidi? You've been playing since Leaf Green? Nice. Yeah, I'm I'm OG red and blue. So I've been through all the updates. I do need another Vulpix for Nine Tails. Oh my god, it's so stinking cute! <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Why are you so cute? But, I like it. I, I do fit in a lot of hours. Uh, you love seeing them in the real world, so you can avoid them. But when you walk through long grass in the older games, oh, so you like the overworld. I guess, yeah, that's true. You can avoid them if you want. Um, let me grab this over here. Is Krikatot a new Pokemon that I need to be grabbing? Um, it's just the tiny ones, and when they're all bunched up together. Um, we'll just put you there for a second, because I just need to use a Firestone on you. There. you guys tell I'm a hoarder? <laughs> uh, the early Pokemon will be busy drinking and partying! <laughs> you hardly played! Oh my goodness. 
Oh my goodness, Curvo. Yeah, my very first Pokemon card was a Ponyta. I do remember that. Shut up. Why are you so Gorgino? Hoard everything. I really do. I really do hoard everything. nine tails back i will say one thing that i do dislike is that if you have a shiny pokemon in older games it showed up in the boxes as shiny but here it does not because if i go to box 32 these are all my shiny pokemon but they don't look shiny unless if i do that look at my shiny fish look at my shiny fish and my blue duck like, uh, it's it's very obviously a blue duck. It's not it's not yellow. So that's that's one thing I don't like about um about this. I think it was the same in Sword and Shield. It didn't show the it did not show the shinies. It's like hey, I went through the difficulties of shiny hunting or finding the shiny. So I noob. Should I be catching a Cricketot? No, because Cricketot was in Paldea. Yeah, no, I should not be catching a Cricketot. Okay. Fantastic. Uh, Swinub. Swinub. But, and they've done some pretty good. You love Psyduck, yeah. Psyduck's awesome. Um, they've done. They've been working on getting updates out, so it's not as laggy. But definitely, some of the graphics are amazing. Some of the graphics not so much. But considering how I would not be able to do a quarter, not even a quarter. I would not be able to do a tenth. Oh, who's Moy? Moy came online. They're playing Coromon. Okay. See, this is what I'm talking about in my my stream title. Am I actually going to get progress done? Or am I just going to be swine up? I need two more of you. Or am I just going to be distracted? I'm just going to be distracted the entire time. Ooh. Like, I've already been playing an hour, and I've only taken the one selfie. My goodness. And there's two parts to the DLC, so I do take back about the DLC might not being worth it. The DLC is worth it because it's $35 and there's two parts to it. Um, Do I need Stantler? Is Stantler new? I really need to memorize this. Um, Stantler is not new. Okay. So right now we're playing the Teal Mask. Oh, okay, hold up. An item. I think one thing I don't like is how many items there are to pick up. But I mean, I know some people like that. I don't know, it's because I, I get distracted so easily I feel like I have to collect all the items and then I get FOMO when I'm like, I don't think I have all the items. Ah! So I don't like how many items there are to pick up. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! What a flop! Well, you know what? Your mom's a flop. <laughs> okay, let's grab this. And then let's see what this terror rate is. I do not need an Ekans. Fantastic. Okay. What are your guys' thoughts on all of the items spread out all over the place? Like, it is so annoying to me. <laughs> so, Terra Vulpix? Okay! Did I evolve? Did I, did I get a Ninetales too soon? What's your Terra? What's your Terra? Huh? Fairy? Ooh. 
I don't actually need it. I probably won't actually use Vulpix or Ninetales. But isn't it just so cute? Let's do a Psycho Cut. <sighs> you like collecting? That's my problem is that it causes me so much distraction. You like that part because you love just exploring and running around, but I also don't like- That's my thing is I'm always afraid of missing things. That's why I don't like it. Is because I'm just like, I'm missing, I'm missing everything. Okay, that terror raid is a little further than I thought. That's fine. But yeah, like, I want to keep doing progress, but I keep getting distracted by these Pokeballs. Pokemon are you? Spinarak, okay. Oh my gosh, Vulpix. Oh, I think I do need a C-Dot. You find things that other people miss too, though. Uh, yeah, I guess. How dare you make sense? <laughs> Maybe I want to open this up a little bit more so I can see who you are. I can see who you are. Okay. Fantastic. So now I have that whole line. Oh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. Ooh, there's a Terra right up here. Let me see what you are. There's a lot of Terra raids. <gasps> Ooh, yes. I'm going to change to King Gambit. Because you're a ghost type. And King Gambit can probably one-shot you. <laughs> How- oh wait, I wasn't looking at the terror type, it's a ground type! I was thinking of its normal type! Oh shimmy shimmy. The FOMO is real, yeah. I made a mistake! You know what, King Gambit is pretty strong no matter what though. Oh, but isn't Dark weak against ground? Let's do a Swords Dance. Is that strong or weak? It's weak! Yas! Do another sword stance. Oh. It's gonna be like taken out by the time I hit it. There's the energy. There's the energy. Oh, you just nullified everything I just did. That is annoying. But, there we go. I actually didn't really need to do much. Okay, let's catch this Lampent. The Pokeball Latch. Actually, you might look better in a... It doesn't matter. It's a free Pokeball. Oh! Hello, Heidi! Hello, Heidi! She's been, Yeah, she's been sniffing. She's been, she's been, like, peeking out a couple times. Oh, also, you have to wa Look, um, my friend had a hedgehog, too. His name was Randy. Oh. Yeah, she's out for a snuffle. Isn't he so cute? Look at his little paws. He's like your little paws. Oh. You're withdrawing. <laughs> so, I had to show you. Because uh, when she saw Heidi, she's like, Heidi looks like my Randy. I do look so much. 
They do. So I was telling them about Hercules being your emotional support animal. Yeah, Kerbo was talking about uh how they don't live very long. Bad. But Heidi was your rescue, right? Yeah. Yeah. She was a rescue. Yeah. Yeah, she's been doing this a couple times. I'm wondering if it's because she's in the cat tree. But got her on camera. She is being really cute. And as Kerbo says, she's out for a snuffle. <laughs> Hold on to her. I have her. Done with her. I'll bring her. She's good. I'm. I'm planning on streaming for a little bit. Okay, um, it's gonna be a couple hours. Uh, Are you guys gonna be on with that by the end of the day? to be. The, the big. But don't you'll be st staying like last night was your last night yeah. here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But at least it's not like you. We have were supposed to have the van already, but there's already. Oof. They are so adorable. Kerbo says they're just. No. She, she seems to be content right there. So as long as I leave the kennel, I'll leave her. Why is it? Well, my plan is to, to stay here when I'm done streaming. I'm going to read so I can take her out to the lift and get some enrichment. So. But she's just. Good. And then that way I can put her on the mat and just make her body. Apparently she her bladder holds a lot of urine. <laughs> I love that Pele is unfazed. First she was like, what? Yeah. <laughs> but uh I've been working on my dog on all the Pokemon. I'm getting super duper distracted. As you know I would. So my... Right, like you want to stick to the, the theme, but then you're like, but a detour. Right? Well, we were just talking about the Pokeballs, how... Stupid they are. Yeah. Well, not, not stupid, Some just... Stupid. I don't like how they distract me so much. I do need another swine nub. And where does lamb pen go? So I, got, I found this little chart um, ah. that has all of the new Pokemon. Uh, that is helpful. Video game. Because they're not technically numbered. No, they're not. So, um, I'm using this one because this one is like it doesn't have Wooper because there is technically a Wooper in the Paldean. But I'm like, no, it's Blue Wooper. So, if it's yellow, it's a new Pokemon. If it's red, it's Scarlet. If it's purple, it's um, Violet. And so, I've been using this. So, Lampin is on the Third box. Um. Oh, the red one. Yeah, because you used violet, right? Yeah, I used violet. Good, because I didn't buy it for violet, apparently. You did. I thought I did too. Because I remember that day very vividly going, oh, heck. So I oh, maybe to... you didn't. I don't know. I thought you did. I thought I did too. I mean, I, I could give you the violet book when you gave me the scarlet. So. Exactly. So, because I have to get Gligar, Gliscar. No, that's Gligar and Gliscar, and then this duck. Yeah, and you just have to get me a palm, a ambi palm, and this Pikachu wannabe. That's the angry elf, as I call it. Oh, okay. That's the one that changes. It's the use, the person in Scarlet. I mean, Short and Shield. Their like enemy has it. Mmm. And when it gets like goes between happy and angry. Okay, yeah, because I never played Sword and Shield. Oh, uh, yeah, it appears in that one. Gotcha, I figured. Here, I think, is funny. And then, yeah, there's the trainers here, which I've been basically just one-shotting because I have my Iron Valiant. Wait, oh, I was like, are we not fighting? I've been using my high-up ones that aren't fully maxed out yet so I can get the, expert, the XP spread, mm -hmm. like my 80s. Yeah, because uh, my Iron Valiant's in the 80s. Um, yeah, so like I'm using my 80s that I haven't maxed out yet. Oh no, Iron Valley's only 68. Kind of perfect. It's, yeah, exactly. It's perfect for this. Story. Yeah. And I have like a little bit of a challenge. Well, I mean, 
one shot. Well, you can still one shot if you're like in a rush, but you could also, like, yeah, you know, give yourself some challenge. And you don't want to be too strong because being um, trying to catch Pokemon, you can't be one shotting them. Well, what I do is I have my King Gambit, and then it has False Swipe. Um, and False Swipe is a move. Uh, wrong. One. False Swipe. Um is it, it won't let it go past one hp so because king gambit is level 100 so if i false swipe it it takes it all the way down to one hp which makes it really easy to catch unless if they use an attack that hurts themselves so look y'all i'm teaching my roommate pokemans a... <gasps> wait ralts is not new <laughs> it's like, ralts! i know i think i do it all the time i do so. do i have you and if i do and i just kill yeah, but I definitely hate all the Pokeballs. <laughs> as a cozy gamer, as a completionist, I need to find them all. I don't need. Is that you? I like the nutball. Yeah, it's a squawkabilly. Hey guys, you woke up the Pele. Sorry for that little distraction. My roommate's actually uh, moving out today. So. Very sad, very sad. Another squawkabilly. But she's been playing the DLC, and she's actually the reason why I've been wanting to play it a lot. Uh, is because she's been sitting on the couch just playing and being like, oh my gosh, there's this. And, and she's like, no, I don't want to spoil it. I'm like, I'll play it eventually. So here I am. Playing it. Ooh, we're gonna get some uh, evolutions. Nice. And yeah, so Heidi will be with us the whole day. Her her home just got packed up and moved away. Um. Oh, go on, go on, chill with us. I've done it to you, now you wanna play? <laughs> I need to go back and check my purchases to see. I'm pretty sure I bought Violet. Huh? Yeah. I'm pretty sure, cause at that time I didn't have a care in the world with money. Now I'm like, oh, I can only afford to eat one time a day. I ate my one time today. But I think I'm gonna pick up, um, cause the fried rice actually doesn't cost that much. Cause a bag of rice doesn't cost much. And then, um, the eggs don't cost as much as I thought. Though the price of eggs, oh, oh boy. But now Kerbo wants to play the DLC, so I'm an influencer. Yeah. Uh, here, here I am. I'm out here influencing. But there's a really big part of me that just wants to play Paleo right now and check all my worm farms. Uh, Jean was telling me a story last night and. Partway through, I'm like, oh, I need to check on my worm farms. So as she's telling me this story, I'm like, one second, I need to hop on and sell all this stuff. Paleo really does have me buy a chokehold. Okay. So you go there. And then Poliwhirl is good. Uh, where do I get the syrupy apple? Have you figured that out yet? Um, I feel like you get that from the festival. Have you yeah. Not yet. I just took my selfie at the first board. I've... I think you get it at the... Okay. Yeah, I've not gotten to the festival yet. I would have to check my... Yeah, no, because you... then you'll get distracted. Like, I, I do. Packed away. Exactly. But I'm pretty sure you get some sort of apple when you... That's it's probably... probably... Yeah. Yeah, probably. Oh, I got some star pieces. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it, it says right there. Prism scale. Very pretty. Okay. Also, get rid of any exclamation marks. You made a couple extra worm farms? I don't know. I don't blame you, Kerbo, because even five does not feel like enough. Five feel... Worm farms? I only have five. Oh, I, you should have. I, I should have ten. I don't have. Ha oh, 
Were you actually just speaking, not a trainer? The Land Academy is super hilly. It's a great challenge for any courier worth their... Oh, I already fought you. That's why. <laughs> um, I don't have the materials to build 10. And I need to buy extra um, licenses to have more machines. I should. But I've been more... I've been more... Uh, interested in building up my conservatory soon. Welcome to Kitakami Hall. Not long now before the big festival starts. Hey! I keep running into things and people. We're at Kitakami Hall. Yatta! You had to buy a couple new licenses? Yeah, I would definitely have to. Buy stuff at the stall. Oh no, they're setting up. They're setting up. That's so cute. Yeah. Oh, Snorlax is so small. Your last license cost you twelve thousand. Dang. Yeah, I definitely oh, don't want to think about getting more licenses. Five is enough because I run out of cakes. Oh, before the week is out. So five is enough. I just need to be patient because it takes time for the worms to eat the cake. But. Okay, not me. Here we go, y'all. I'm getting- I'm gonna be getting distracted. I need to show off my paleo real fast. Um, let me close this. I need- I need to show off what I've been doing, and then I'll go right back to Pokemon, okay? Okay. <laughs> hiss. hiss? Hiss? No hiss. I'm excited. Eh? Why are you wrong? Oh, because I forgot this. Not me not knowing my own password. I should be at home. If I'm not at home, I'll teleport home, show off my conservatory, and then... I need to see if the buildings are built yet. Though it said eight... It takes eight hours? Ugh. Rude. Oh, I do need to. I'm only playing this just for a second. Shh. Okay. So the buildings are a little off because this large room needs to go down here, and the oh, small room is going to be on the side. Um, but it, I, I need I need these to finish upgrading. Um, but I also needed stone for this one. But do you see what I mean by it's going to be a big U? So what's going to happen is this one's going to go here. And then this one's going to go here on the side. So it's going to be like a little U. I don't know if I'll have enough room though. We'll have to see. But yes, yeah, so that's, that's what I was working on. It's very similar to yours. I just like the idea of a courtyard. You know, um, I started putting out the bugs and organizing the bugs. So like the two crabs, the little leaf hoppers, um, and then the fish are being organized. I need the long nosed unicorn fish to go on top of here and then the blue marlin to go on top of here. So yep, yeah, that, that's my Palea. That is Palea. Back to Pokemon. The tuna gives it a bombastic side eye. There we go. There we go. See, it wasn't too much. Oh, oh my god. I would love to have pathing. Oh. Okay. See, it wasn't too big of a distraction for me. Okay, do I talk to you? Oh, it's the caretaker. Welcome to Kitakami Hall. We're glad to have you here. Relax and enjoy yourself. The terrain tool. Oh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, there's the signpost. There we go. I've arrived at my destination. Pokeball. Okay. Oh, you meant those Pokeballs. Yeah, those Those are side quests that I always want. They're so annoying. But I, I can't resist. Right? Same here. 
That's the second sign. Like, Bit tricky. Where am I on my path? <laughs> Bit tricky to find, huh? Not really, because I have a map. So, sorry, I'm falling out of distance. So I, you're a stalker, Kieran. I love that we have a love interest now. Well, who well, loves us? Not us loving them. But like, crush. he's got a crush on me. He really likes me. He really likes me. But no, yeah, definitely terrain tool for for like the Sims. Oh, would love that. Um, I hope you can get used to me showing up like this. Now then, let's read the sign. The ogre possessed four mysterious glimming, glimmering, glimmering masks. It, it is said that depending on the mask the ogre donned, the powers of his cudgel would change. Oh, so I'm guessing the ogre is the legendary Pokemon that we're gonna yeah. catch? Yeah. When wearing the teal mask, it could bring life- Oops, sorry, I moved the camera. Uh, bring life back into the withered greenery around it. When wearing the crimson mask, it could turn a candle's flame into a raging inferno. When wearing the blue mask, it could stop the very flow of a river. When wearing the ashen gray mask, it could easily break the hardest stone in two. Before the loyal three fell, they rest rested away three of the ogre's masks, greatly weakening it. So it must still have the teal mask, because that's what the DLC is called. <laughs> Did you read it? Yeah. The masks the loyal three stole are kept over at Kitakami Hall. Everyone in town is sick is scared of the ogre, but me, I really like it. It was strong and cool, and it didn't even care when everyone shunned it. I always wanted to be like that, ever since I was a kid. I want to be as cool as the ogre. My sis sorta of ends up doing everything for me, even when we're at school. I want to try and get stronger so I can do things for myself, you know? I'm going to become someone people can rely on. Then just maybe I could be that ogre's friend. Aww, he's cute. Oh, um, right, picture. We're supposed to take a picture. You can take the next one too if you don't mind, Sam. Oh, we're adorable. Hold up, I want to keep that one. We're adorable. Whew, I knew it was the right call to let you handle it, Sam. Now, on to the next signboard. Oh, and you know the mountain the stories say the ogre lives on is actually Oni Mountain. You can climb it from the stairs over there. If you wanted, we could go see the ogre's home. <gasps> like a day! <laughs> Folks called it the dreaded den. I wanna see it! Are you at Petco tomorrow? Yep. 11 a.m.? 11.30. I might go in to get some cat litter. I need to change it. Yes, I really wanted to you to see it for yourself, Sam. So if you keep climbing up, you'll reach the Infernal Pass. There's a sign before that. If you turn at the sign, you can get to the dreaded den. So, so I'll just head up up then. Come along when you're ready. And, and be careful. He's adorable! Okay. Visit the dreaded den. Ooh, I want to go to the crystal pool. Looks like I might have- Oh, I finally have one that's- No, that's a event. You were talking about the dark one. Never mind, ignore me. Oh, there's a hoot hoot! I bet you it's only at night time that the hoot hoot comes out. I want to see the masks, and I want to do the Terra raid, and I want to do everything. Oh, I bet you the masks are inside there. I bet you I'm not allowed to see the masks. Okay. Wee. Oni Mountain. A mean foo? Of course I'll fight for the mean foo. A water type Pokemon. Let's go with Polyrath. See if you can actually hold up your own. It's only a three star. just chilling. Maybe she's just sleeping. She is, yeah. I'm surprised at how much she's poked her nose out. In the moon. 
That was a critical hit. Motherfucker! <laughs> yeah! Oh, he's so Gotta catch them all, Pokemon! Oh, did you want to see the book that I've been writing for Memories of a Blue Team? Oh, I saw your face. Isn't it cute? At some time, point, I'm gonna have to bring it in so I can pixie dust it. <laughs> I caught the mean foo! I am so surprised! I didn't think that would happen. I know, I was kind of nail biting for a moment. Mm hmm. <laughs> I don't even know if they can hear you on the stream. So it sounds like I'm just talking to myself. I mean, sometimes I have my viewers will chat with me. I always like those. Okay, where does Mean Foo go? Mean Foo goes in the third box. Where did, where did Mean Foo? Oh, in my party. Oh. I actually need to catch a third, uh, a second one. He goes third row. Oh, Jingling! There we go. Because Mean Food does evolve. Oh. It lagging so much. Okay. Sorry for the lag there. Rough, old picks. Hound hour. Okay, let's let's continue with ugh. I, as I say that I see a Pokeball. Let's continue with the plot. Cause I can catch Pokemon off stream. Timber, is Timber new? I think Timber is new, yeah. I would definitely remember we have Conkodur. Conkodur. What's the ball at? Yay! Easy peasy lemon squeezy. I do need to catch two more timber. Because it has two evolutions. Saw one right there. I hate that my headphones are broken because I can't hear any of the sounds out of my right headphone. But I won't be able to hear you, so I have my left one out off my ear. <laughs> so Bell Sprouts can evolve into Weeping Bell. And then I can evolve it into Victory Bell with a la uh, with a grass stone. What were they even thinking when they designed Weeping Bell and Victory Bell? Stone. Or Leaf Stone, not Grass Stone. And Kerbo, I saw flowers in the background there when it was evolving and my first thought was it's spice sprouts why is it lagging so much Let's 
see if this will work. You still have too many spice sprouts. Yeah. Well, now that I've been, <gasps> I see Growlithe. Now that I've been, um, yeah, I know, but Growlithe's are cute. Um, I was copper hunting earlier, and I got a lot of spice sprouts. And I see another timber right there. So it's going to be in the second box. The first one goes there. Okay. And... Here goes here. Perfect. So the first box is almost done. We're going to get the Vanny, which is friendship. And then Ilamuse and Volbeat go here. Ugh. I do need a third swine nub. Okay. That's fine. Uh, so let's get the third timber. Hello, I'm here to capture you. I hope you do not mind. <sighs> I don't feel like you got much done because you were doing quests. I feel like you got a lot done because like you've been working a lot on the friendships as well. Which I have not been doing. Hey, you look like you're a trainer. Who are you? Oh, it's landed. The mountains. I need to go in. I, I need to work more on friendships and giving gifts. When you come to the mountains, you can only do two things. Hike and sleep. I don't know. I don't go to the mountains often. It's an Alolan sand true. Shut up. How did you get an Alolan sand true, which is ice type, which I think is weak to fighting? Yeah, look at me. I'm the Pokémon master. Uh, you just need to dedicate a bit of time to it when you first start, then do other stuff after. Um. Yeah, I mean, I just try to talk to them when I see them. I, I need to focus on giving gifts. Look at Alolan Vulpix. I love Alolan Vulpix. It's so stinking cute. <gasps> okay. When you come to the mountains, you can only mountain climb and mountain battle. Okay. I disagree, but okay. Will I be able to get Alolan Vulpix here? I want an Alolan Vulpix. Geodude is new, but I don't think- no, Noibat and Noivern are not. I need to get three Geodudes. I also want to get the achievement for giving liked and loved gifts. So I also need to do that in Palea. Okay. Oh, you're not Geodude. I just need one more Geo Dude. Maybe today I'll dedicate some time to building friendships. But I hate that you can only give gifts once a day. That's rude. 
understand why they do it, but it's rude. <laughs> Okay, sweet. And I need to put Geodudes, the Geodudes in their spot, which is... Um, there. Perfect. Excuse me. I did a little burp. Ooh, Carbink. Is that normal type? I think that's normal type, so I'm gonna send out Iron Hands. I think that's normal. I hope that's normal. Oi. How you doing, Heidi? Sleeping. Heidi's doing a little sleep. It is normal type. I was right. Oh, yeah. <sighs> okay, we do a belly drum. Ooh, light stream, but that's special attack. Sweet. I am a- oh, that's physical attack. Dang, it got me. Oh boy! But I got it! <laughs> you see that? You see that? <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> yeah, I ain't gonna help you, Charbink. I'm too strong. Even with you nullifying that attack increase I got. You did. You gone. Where does Carvink go? Carvink is the first one in the fourth box. I should give you a cool ball. Let's give you the heavy ball. Boy, that was awesome! I nearly one shot at that car bank. Noise. Noise, 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 noise. There's a Skrelp in chat. A wild Skrelp appears. Okay, we got carving. Carbink is the first in the fourth box. <gasps> you don't have Skrelp, Kerbo. Catch it, catch it now. Do it, do it now. With an Ultra Ball, dang, no kill like overkill. I got a rare bone for you. A ten is not new. None of you are new. You only use Ultra Balls? <laughs> I mean, why not? If you got the money for it. Okay, at least this path seems semi-straightforward. It doesn't have too many new Pokemans. Skrelp has been caught by Kerbo! Aw, oh, yeah! 
We're on Oni Mountain. Is Cleffa and Clefable and Clefairy new? They are sweet. Oh, Opie's cuddling you while you rest. That's cute. Opie is cute. Haley's just sleeping on the bed. Wait, where'd you go, Clefairy? Clefairy. Hi. Oh, you're a cutie. Should I catch you in a love ball? Nah. Uh, nah. I only got one. I don't know how to get new ones. But Pele is over on the bed, as per usual. Heidi. I'm gonna see if I can close the curtain a little bit so that we can see Heidi a little bit better. Is that better? Take a look. Yeah, that is better. Also, we're getting to the hot point of the day where it's good to keep our blinds closed so the apartment doesn't get as hot. He likes to do this. He doesn't like to be lifted or cuddle, but he does things like that, which you take as him cuddling you. Yeah, Pammy will do that too. She climbs on me all the time. Okay. So we do need a Cleffa and a Clefable. Gonna lurk whilst we eat some dinner. Thank you for the lurk. Enjoy your din din. I hope it's delicious. I hope it's delicioso. But thank you for the lurk. Oh no, we have we have a choice, y'all. We have a choice. We can go to the infernal pass or the dreaded death. It says danger. Do not enter. Oh my gosh. There's a chingling. I need the chingling. Uh, is coughing and wheezing new? They are, so I need to catch two cofflings. Cofflings? Coughings. Kieran, it says do not enter the dreaded den. What are you talking about? Like, why, why are you trying to get me in danger? Why are you trying to get me in trouble? I knew you were trouble when you walked in. First things first, let me grab this. Second thing second, let me check this. A knock towel, which is actually pretty good. You know what? I think I can do it with Iron Valiant. Cause I've got Leaf Blade. Moonblast should not be super effective. At least we've got more progress done today than yesterday. <laughs> yesterday I didn't even get to a single signpost. I got two today. I think I'm gonna faint after the next hit. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. Just getting, just getting back into it. Yeah, getting back into it, but also it was brand new and it was all like, ooh. Now I'm like a little bit more focused. <laughs> Come 
on, y'all. We've almost broken its stance. Let's do this. There we go. A couple more strong hits and we got it. Moonblast should not be super effective against me. Aren't I a fairy type? Free knocked out, I'll take that. Sweet! Got knocked out! I need to go catch two coughings, and then I will go to the dreaded den. Got a new Pokemon. Noish, 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 noish. You're another chingling. Wait, where are the coughing? Where did the coughing go? That's rude. There were literally so many coughing. Was it a coughing outbreak that I missed? That's rude. I see Pichu and Bonsley. Now, if they didn't want people to go to the Dreaded Den so much, then maybe they shouldn't have made it so easy. Maybe they should have put up a little barricade or something. Just a thought. Yeah, are you ready to be wrecked? Get wrecked, son! <laughs> about the Terra Geo dude. Saw you. <laughs> Thought you could hide from me. Also gonna do a cheeky save. I've arrived at my destination. Karen, why did you want to cut me to come to this dangerous place? Damn, did you have trouble getting across that narrow path? There it is, the dreaded den. This is supposed to be the ogre's home. At least that's what, I, what everyone says. I've come here all the time, but I've never seen it. Maybe a powerful ogre like that would only show up if it heard some kind of battle going on. Oh, oh yeah, I think I've gotten a bit stronger since last time we battled, so, you know, if you wanted to... We could battle? <laughs> you so cute. Let's do it. Alright. So, uh, we should heal up our teams first. Thank you. I'll give it all I got. I got this. Okay, let's take on Poke Trainer Kieran again. This Furret, which is weak. This time I'll put up a good fight. It's weak to close combat. Noish, 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 noish. But that was just one attack. Oh man, it did so much damage. I like that they respond to, like, how you, uh, fight, you know? Yanma. How about, I have Psycho Cutter. Oh, Psycho Hit's not super effective? I thought it was super effective against bug types. 
Ouch. That hurt. Whoa, that attack made my heart skip a beat. Holly Whirl. Keep current Pokemon. Hydrate! Okay. This is the last one. Super effective Leaf Blade. Oh yeah! There we go. Oh man, I lost. I knew it. You really are strong, Sam. How am I ever going to be able to beat you? If the ogre saw that battle, I'm sure he'd be thinking that kid's got real strength. I devastated him. <laughs> See, in my school, Blueberry Academy, it's a school that specializes in teaching the art of Pokemon battle, and if I was strong as you, maybe I could aim to be the best trainer there. Let's go have a look in the, at the ogre's den. Oh? Was it watching us? The ogre was watching us! Yours. Watch your head. He's got a crush on us. See how dark it is in here and cramped? Even the floor's all rough and uneven. Living all alone in a place like this would get pretty miserable, don't you think? Poor ogre, we have plenty of room at our house. I would have totally let it stay with us. <laughs> when can I move in? I don't know if we'd have room for the both of you, Sam. But if the ogre really did show up to stay at our place, I'm sure the whole town would freak. Why don't people realize it's just a Pokemon? Like, we live in the world of Pokemon. Oh, no way, the sun's already gone down? Guess we'll have to save the last signboard for tomorrow. Oh, I almost forgot. Today's the first day of the Festival of Masks over at Kitakami Hall. It's this big event where everyone puts on masks and runs around celebrating. I mean, it's not like you've got to go or anything, but if you wanted to, you know, check it out, well, it'd be fun. Let's get together! Aww, cute kid. Yeah, why not? It'd be great to go together. There's just a few things we'd have to get ready first, so we should swing by my house before heading to the festival. We live in the northwest corner of the village. It's some... let's see, I could maybe draw a map. Oh, your Rotom phone has a map in it, huh? Sorry, that's cute. You want me to register it on your map? Yeah, I could give that a try. Wowzers, it sure is handy having a map that shows you everything right here on your phone. I'm gonna ask if I can get a Rotom phone someday, too. I'll be right behind you if you want to head to my family's place first. See you there! Hold up. They're cute together. They're so cute together. Okay. And now that it's nighttime, Hoot Hoot should be showing up. Ooh! Oni's Maw. Oh, I see. It looks like. Okay. I want to see if I can find a coughing again. Oh, I'm glad I did that. Super Fang, nice. Boldine Escapade. So many Pokeballs. Oh, a Moonstone. Wow. No! That's not what I wanted to do. Ooh, 
Ooh, there's a little cave over there. Let me grab this Pokeball and then I'll go explore the cave. Oh, I can catch my third swine up here. Nice. And then I might actually wrap up stream there before I get to Kieran's house, because I can still at least explore a little bit off stream. Because I don't know if I'll be able to stream tomorrow. I did pick up a, a shift from 12.30 to 6.30. I actually can't go to Petco tomorrow to pick up litter. Oof. I thought it was 1.30 that I was going to work. But oops. Um, but what we're gonna do... Hold up. Save. There we go. Um, but yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna pause there for a second. Um, that way I can go see who we are going to go rad. I would like to rad somebody. I think I saw Mallory online. Let's see. We've got Moonstone Island, Fae Farm, Stardew Valley, Disney Dreamlight Valley, Valorant, or Fae Farm. Yeah, thank you for joining me. I always appreciate it. Whenever whenever people come in, I'm, I always appreciate when people come in. Um... Ba, ba, ba. We haven't done Oh Ashley Darling in a while. Mallory's doing Skull Cavern Roulette. Let's let's go over to Mallory. I shall. I'm going to read a lot and hang out with Heidi. So if you're not following an amateur archaeologist, she's a pretty awesome creator who does a lot of Stardew Valley challenges. Um and I'm the one who actually taught her. So <laughs> But yeah, I hope you guys have a fantastic day. I will try to stream tomorrow night. We'll have to see. We'll have to see because I have to do laundry tomorrow night as well. Um, but yeah, I hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you next time. Bye bye. You're going to watch some of your YouTube shows and chill noise.